hi this is sherry veronica i'm gonna play what this guy is saying but what he just said i recently discovered well maybe a decade or so ago i discovered it after coming back to america out of barbados and it took me i was disappointed in myself because i feel as though i should have discovered it sooner but hey to each their own yeah but what he said is men may not be human that they are um like bots and when i discovered what he's saying now about a decade ago i i had to i had to change my whole outlook on life and it's almost as though at this point a lot of the guys are invisible i'm not saying all but most 99 percent are invisible and i can't understand why guys try to be with young very young women because they don't want to pick up the mess that they have left behind or other men have left behind or other males have left behind they know what they are and they don't want to deal with it so they want to have like the, the the least resistance so they'll pick up a very young girl to settle down with but when the young girl starts to come into her own you know she yeah she may want to push up and then he'll he'll replace her because if you like young girls you like young girls it's always going to be a replacement kind of thing but yeah what he said about guys i 100 percent agree with i see sperm as ai you talk about oh you have to be careful ai is coming in to take over and ai is going to be here and it's going to take no ai is sperm and the it's like a bewitching a bewitching spirit that it has on women it's very bewitching and i think women have women should be very careful girls should be very careful when they are engaging in that kind of behavior it's it's almost like uh, it's almost for me <laughs> I, I don't, for me I, I, I think that you've been infected. It's like an infection. And I, I, I think that people are infected when they're in that particular realm. But um, let, let's listen to him. Listen to him and, and see, see what you think. And you can give your opinions, okay? Don't listen to me. I don't trust me. I don't believe me. This is true. I'm not saying every single man. I'm saying like I don't believe you right now. I think you knew exactly what the words were that you were talking about. You came up here, but that's fine, right? Neither here nor there. But like I don't trust men in general because men play stupid games all the time, all the time. They're hella manipulative, and uh, men think that they're that men always are playing a game. It's always like an angle. There's always like some bullshit behind it. They're very rarely genuine, real life human beings. Most men are NPCs, unfortunately, or robots. That's the that's that's the that's the thing about me. That's something that I know about me from being a He said NPCs, non-contributing players. It's like let's say there's a video game and they have the stars and they're battling and then you see people in the background. The background is NCPs and that's what he said. And he's saying that males are NCPs, okay? Non-contributing players or maybe it's another, um, the other words for it, but that's what it means that they're just in the background that they are not really the main players. Okay, let him continue. Yeah, man, that's something that I know about men from observing men, and that's something that I know about men looking at history and looking at current times, looking at the numbers, looking at the data. Men aren't really human. We're not really human beings. We don't function like human beings. We, we function like something else. Yeah, he's saying that men are not human. And when I returned to America, my home, from Barbados after I was violated there, I came with that impression that then I, I said they're not quite human or I was using other words yeah really bad but yeah but yeah I, I realized I, don't, I I just could not bring myself to believe it but I really think I actually clued in late but I'm glad that I clued in because um, it could have been worse hey it could have been I could have been still thinking that there's good in everyone and all that kind of romance kind of thing but no men are that males are different and even after me in my situation that person moved on and then they paid someone to come in 
to um, on a live their wife and you know so you can see the patterns you can see patterns and I'm just glad that I dodged that bullet here he goes again women are way closer to humanity if not fully immersed in humanity right but men are not <laughs> men are not children and women are real people for the most part men are not that's why men treat women and children and other men but women and children specifically help me spread the word about naked departure via social media yeah that's it you heard it from the horse's mouth he spoke as a male and he's saying that he he don't he doesn't listen to other males not not straight across the board i'm sure he has a few people but he says that they're not human they're not human and you know they're ncps and i came away like i said i came away from being violated in barbados with that same sentiment and shame on me that that i didn't discover it discover it like earlier I, I i should have i should have known better and i should have discovered that uh you're dealing with a different species that's why i've always said we are dealing with a different species and i don't know why women have been picked to bring it forth because we are actually bringing forth our oppressors but that's the way it is at this point until it changes in the future and i'm sure i'm sure that women are going to wake up and clue in and it's going to be different there's going to be a different um game here on the earth this is sherry veronica